Hello and welcome to Junk Drawer Magic, where we show you how to perform modern day miracles with stuff in your junk drawer. Uh, Kira, why do you have oven mitts on? I've been practicing some pretty crazy sorcery lately. I'm wearing these so I don't accidentally hurt somebody. Well, take them off. They look silly and this is a serious show. Fine, but I warned you. They look like normal hands to me. Sure, they look normal, but these babies can do just about anything. I'll show you. I can make this plastic cap go right into the bottle. But the cap's way too big. Not a problem. We'll just put it in my magic hand. What? Where'd it go? It's in here. Now all we need to do is shoot it into the bottle. What? We'll teach you how to do this trick next. Ready to make a bottle cap travel through time and space? Almost got it. Just need five or 10,000 more tries. Let's go to the junk drawer. For this trick, all we'll need is a water bottle with a label and two water bottle caps. First, we're gonna show you how to make the bottle cap vanish from your hand. Start by holding the bottle cap like this. Then, go to grab it with your other hand, but instead, drop it. Now the audience thinks the bottle cap is in this hand, and while they're distracted, you can pocket the cap or drop it on the floor. Nice. So the screwed on cap is not the final cap. Yep, the final one's been in the bottle the entire time. You just couldn't see it, because I hid it behind the label. Getting the cap inside the bottle is actually the easiest part. Most water bottles with thin caps can be bent in half. After bending it, put the cap in the bottle and then stick your finger in to straighten it out. Now all you have to do is remember to keep it behind the label and only show the bottle sideways. After you're done, you can even hand the bottle over to an audience member to prove that it's not a trick bottle. Sounds simple enough. Well, let's give it a shot. Thanks for watching Junk Drawer Magic. It's good to know that you don't actually have magical hands, so I have nothing to be worried about. But you do. My hands are dangerous. Nice try, Akira. But if anyone's hands are dangerous, it'd be me. Face it, I'm not really magical. OK, but I warned you. Ow! Take it back. Never! Take it back. And you really are magical. Ah! That's better. Bye, everyone. Glide your fingers across. Make sure it's still there. Is it still there? Yeah. <sighs> what? But I saw it. I felt it. We'll show you how to do this trick next.